Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm Gina. It is Margaret Miller Day. <laughs> Yay! I love this day. Uh, CW Planner Day. And it's week 28. <laughs> We're on the downside of the year. Yeah. So, uh, this is my planner that I'm working in now. Last half of the year. Um, I did this week. Well, I've already taken out my pages. I did the first week in it last week. Yep. Did I skip a week? No, 27. Oh, I did 20. Yeah, okay. I got a little nervous there. <laughs> anyway, so this was this week, and I've already taken out my pages. Oops, sent that flying. I lose that thing all the time. <laughs> I'm always getting there, like, to the end of the the, the, the thing and thinking, oh, where is that thing? <laughs> So I've already prepared my pages because I mean, you know I gotta cover up the calendar part. I guess I don't, but I, I always feel like I gotta do that. And I gotta tell you that um, doing this um, part of it is so I just love it. It's like therapy for me to just do this collage. And, yeah, I love it. <laughs> I just I just love putting this paper on here, and I don't know, I like it. <laughs> so I uh, that. I like doing that part. So I got that already, and I keep moving. My 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 mat seems like it's just like sliding all around today. Just I touch it and it moves. <laughs> so I will tell you what we need. And I had trouble finding stuff today. I don't know why. So something related to coffee. That was what I had trouble finding. I thought I would have coffee stuff everywhere. And I kept finding tea. If it would have been tea, I would have found it right off the bat. I had lovely tea images in my old uh, magazine stuff, but I had a hard time finding coffee. But I did find some coffee stuff, and I'm not sure what I'm going to use. I found this lovely old coffee grinder grinder in an um, Ideal magazine. And then this was in one of my old Better Homes and Garden image it magazines or catalog and there's they're having their morning breakfast and it's got this lovely image with the coffee cup I love it and this couple looks like they belong in that kitchen to me so that may be what I use I'm thinking that's probably what I'm going to use and then I uh, cut this out of a magazine for coffee cake and then this was also not a magazine. Uh, ooh, Gina, let's get let's get it together today. <laughs> that was in a cookbook, and this was in an old cookbook. This was an old old cookbook. I like this on this side. Poor man's cookies. <laughs> but on this side, it's all about coffee. So I think that will also go in this, you know, in the background. So a lot of my background is going to be covered up, but I still love doing my background. Yeah, that was in. Let me grab that. This one. It's not like old, old, but it's old. It's the Scandinavian cookbook. It was 29 cents. Let me see if it has. I love old cookbooks. Maybe you don't, but I know a lot of us do. Oh, it's 1955. That's not old, old, but it just looks old, and it, I just loved it when I saw it. I thought I've got to get that for my for my um, junk journals, and I really haven't used it much, but it's just a cool old book. So, yeah. Okay, now on with what we're doing. Okay, something in the shape of a hexagon. So, this is out of a quilt magazine. If you see your quilt magazines. These pictures of quilts, I find these very usable. I use them a lot for backgrounds and stuff. So I just realized they're hexagons. <laughs> I didn't even notice that. Um, I am going to die cut this in the shape of a hexagon. So we're going to do that. So that's going to be my hexagon. I hadn't even thought. I was looking at colors and that, and if it's big enough for my hexagon, I wasn't even paying attention. This was my other choice. But I think this is too bright for all of the things that I'm using. So that was the color scheme. Uh, okay. Um, 
Ah, I skipped something with a bit of pink. This is my something with a bit of pink. And this is from an art magazine. And I think that is beautiful. And that kind of goes with the time era, I think, of my coffee. I think it kind of does. I think. I'm not sure. But anyway. Um, a photo or a portion of photo. This came out of a Reminisce magazine. And why I'm using this, I don't know. But I like it. I just like it. It's probably out of a women's right movement or something. I don't know. But I like it. I don't know. Not that I'm all pumped up about that. I don't know. I just like that. I like it. I like their dresses. They look like a bunch of friends or I don't know. I love the clothes. I love she's got her little look. <laughs> My grandma had one of those. I love it. Don't yell at me for it. It was the time and that's what they did. Um, I just love it. I just think it's beautiful. <laughs> Okay, um, ink, whatever that means to you. I have this little picture. It's from, a, it's a, was a greeting card. And look, she is using her ink to write a letter. She has her little bottle of ink. Okay, and then the bonus is a piece of a dictionary page. And I got two because I wasn't sure which color of dictionary page I would want but this dictionary page has coffee on it and this dictionary page is all about coffee so whichever color dictionary page I'm gonna want on the page this one is not white white so that's I didn't want a white white I knew that but I didn't know, like, I've got a lot of browns. I've got a lot of browns, so I might want to bring in something that's a little bit brighter. So the first thing we're going to do is get my die cutting done so that I can get my big shot off of my desk here because it takes a lot of room. But you know what? Now that I'm used to using it, I really like it. You've always seen me using my, um, my cuddle bug, but somebody, my friend, she gave this to me. She had it because she it is one of our friends that passed away. It is her big shot and she had purchased it and our uh, and she didn't need it because she has some more. She has some and so she asked me if I would like it. Well, the cuddle bug, you cannot buy the, the plates for it anymore. But I'll tell you what I love <laughs> is this this um, thing here. It's magnetic, <laughs> and I put that on there, and it stays where it belongs. No more um, using tape. <sighs> oh, wow! I know y'all. You've been doing this for years, but you know I've been using my cuddle bug since the beginning of time of die cut machines. I mean, you know, like little ones. I got to get some new plates for it, though. That's not in the budget. <laughs> so, oh, I'm just so thankful that she gave this to me. I, I'm telling you, I've been so blessed. And there we go. We have our hexagon. So, I need to put this over here where I will not leave it. And I'm going to set this back on my Rascog real quick so I do not lose it. Is that how you say that? I've always wondered, is it Rascog, Rascog? How do you say that? I guess you really can't tell me <laughs> in the comments because I won't be able to understand what you're saying. Oh, the thing fell. Well, well, well. Okay, got it on there good enough. I have I have it in my brass cog and then like at the back I've got some dies that are real tall and so I've got them leaning, you know, behind it and so when I went to put it they all like slid. <laughs> okay, so I will not throw that away because I can probably cut dice 
out of that. All right, so now we need, what did I do with everything? Okay, here it is. <laughs> scatterbrain today. <laughs> you're, you're probably thinking a little bit. <laughs> what do you mean a little bit? All right, I kind of need to get an idea here. I think I'm going to use this. How much of that do I want to use? Well, you know, the first thing I'm going to do is just kind of pick the top and bottom of that and see how much of that. I really like that kitchen. So let's First thing, let's just take that off. Um, I'm gonna get rid of this for a minute. It's driving me crazy. And then I definitely need to take off this part. Okay. And one of our things is a bit of pink, so this kitchen definitely has that. Um, I think I'll take off, you know, like down here, just a little bit of that, and all of that down there. I'd like to keep the stove. We don't need all of the small cabinets here. Hopefully that much. Mm, I like the toast showing. I like that showing. So let's see if we can keep that of it on there and still have okay and then I've got this big photo now I can take some of this photo off I'm gonna have to ink it back up but that's okay oh oh look at that terrible job I just did oh no See if I can straighten that up a bit. I did. I can take some of this off here. Make sure I did a, do a good job there. I hate to take their heads off. All right. So yeah, that fits better. Now I've got her. I can take some of this off too. We'll see. Maybe I want to tear it. Maybe I just want to tear all the way around on this one. Sorry, I'm trying to... My hands, it has been raining like crazy here and it's making my hands hurt so bad and so my thumbs are not work and so I have a hard time tearing like this. I'm just kind of tearing around it a little bit here. But my thumbs, this motion is very hard right now. tore a lot more than I planned on, but okay, that's okay. She can go like right up here, maybe. Okay. Uh, I don't know if I need these people, but I sure do like them. <laughs> I sure like them. I think they're hilarious. So I'm going to try to make them fit here. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, here is my bit of pink um, hexagon. 
sticks are gone. Can we go back here behind them? Oh, okay. Now I just have to get my dictionary page, which that's going to be easy. Um, let's see. Do I want that darker or the lighter? I'm thinking I might want the lighter. So let's tear. I don't know if I can. Oh, this has got gold leafing on the edge. That's a fancy dictionary there. This pair is nice. This I ought to try to stain some of this, you know, like tea dye. This this paper is a nice paper. Oh, this is nice paper. I need to get that dictionary out more often. It's a big dictionary. I bet the spine is that wide. I don't get it out very often. Okay, so I want to put it, let's see. Copy stuff is all down in here. It starts right about here. where it's going to be seen. Okay, so, well, maybe I will put copy on both sides. Let's get the copy off of this one, too. It is right here. This one has a picture of coffee bean. Oh, my hands. I'll tell you, it has rain and rain and rain. And it's so funny because the other night we got out in the garden. It was so dry out there. And we um, got out there and we put a bunch of food on our garden. And um, I'm going to tear the top of this off. And then. I got out there and I put a bunch of straw around to try to help with the weeds. That was fun. <laughs> Not fun at all. And we, we, I found slugs. I was down on my knees putting that straw out there and then I was like, oh my goodness, there's slugs all over. So I gotta figure out how to get that out. My stepfather, so what we need to do is go buy a can of beer. We don't, we don't drink, so <laughs> we're gonna go buy beer. And um, put in a uh, mason jar lid and put them down in there. And he said they crawl up in there and they drown and die. I guess they like beer. <laughs> so we're gonna get our, our slugs drunk. drunk. But the point of the story is, did all that. And then we, uh, well, of course, I, I put the water all in. We put it in my water and can, and I made several trips to, you know, water the all of our plants with the food, you know, that we the food that we put in there. That took forever, and then we watered it watered the thing real good because there was only like a 30% chance of, of rain. It just didn't look like we were going to get any rain at all hardly. And we have it every time there's any chance of rain they take it right back out. And so we watered it real good to get the straw wet you know so that it would stick around on our garden. Well it hasn't stopped raining. <laughs> it has rained and rained and rained and rained and rained and rained. <laughs> that was three days ago. My husband said this morning from it's rain poured since four o'clock. Like poured like it knocked out our internet for hours. We have rural internet, so we have a tower on top of our house that 
talks to the tower on top of the bridge that's about three miles away. So we lose internet quite often. We're not lucky enough to have like fiber or whatever that's called. But we're still, you know, a few decades away from everybody. <laughs> It's just poor. <laughs> so I guess our plants are not dry anymore. We've been nervous about our water bill, what it's going to be like, but our garden sure looks good. We um, put it where there's never ever been a garden or anything in our yard. And it's pretty close to where our septic tank is too. <laughs> we didn't put it right on top just in case it has to be dug up. That would be bad if they had to come dig up our septic tank and dig our garden up. That would be, oh that would be sad. Oh I cry. <laughs> but it's close. Close, it's close, but we know where they have to dig, so it, we wouldn't have to dig it up. That would be awful. Oh, I guess I'm probably not going to get the coffee cake on there. I guess that's not going to go. I'll tell you a funny when I was a kid, I did not, when mom would make coffee cake, I didn't want coffee cake because I thought you had to have coffee when you had coffee cake. <laughs> I missed out on the coffee cake. <laughs> Isn't that awful? <laughs> I just missed out. Missed the good stuff. Didn't know what I was missing, did I? Oh, look how crooked. Goodness gracious. I was looking for my pink thing and I missed. Got that on. Crooked big time. Oh, goodness gracious. Okay, now where was I going to put the other one? Where did I put the other one? <laughs> um, this was going to go so far. Think. Did I think? Where did it go? Where did it go? Where did it go? I lost it. Huh. I lost the other. There it is. Oh, I need to make sure I got it in the right place because I want that to show. Okay. So on this side, we've got this one up here I think. I just love them. They just look like they belong in this kitchen. Okay. Oh, this goes behind them. I'll put that back there. Huh. That's weird. This is uh, from a um, quilt magazine. A big time quilt magazine. And the advertisement on the back is for a quilt store that's very near me. That's funny. <laughs> that's something that wouldn't happen very often, is it? I mean, it was a thick quilt magazine. <laughs> that's weird. <laughs> Wasn't expecting to see that. just did. I need my brain on me today. I got a lot of things on my mind. I'm getting packed up and ready to leave. Which I need to tell you that this coming week I am just not going to have videos. I'm sorry. I've got a video up for Monday, tomorrow. But I'm not ready and I've got to leave. I'm leaving 
well actually I, when this is up on Sunday I will have left yesterday <laughs> and I just don't have the videos I've tried I've tried I've tried I've been in here every day and I just have not got them up I'm sorry uh, there's just been so much going on in my life good stuff not bad stuff and leaving is good stuff my daughter just needs some help um, with some appointments she's got some appointments going on and she just needs me down there to help with the kids um, while she's got these appointments going on she can't run and do it all by herself and so you know Mama's gonna go help. I don't want a coffee cover up that coffee cup or that coffee make the then I cup percolator or something like that. I don't drink coffee, so I don't know all this stuff. I'll move them over because I, I can't cover that up. Um, anyway, I'm just not gonna have them. I'm gonna be in here today, but tomorrow my husband and I are gonna be out of town all day. I've got a doctor appointment, and we have it's hard here because we have to drive way out of town to. Um, make it to appointments and so that makes it hard because then we can't we don't yeah I'm gonna put that right there I don't have I don't it takes a whole darn day and then so tomorrow for me, I make, I'm make re i recording this on Thursday, so tomorrow for me is Friday, and so I'm going to be gone all day for my doctor appointment, and it's an important doctor appointment for me. I'm probably going to have to have surgery, I, I mentioned it a few weeks ago, so it's to discuss that, it's nothing it's nothing bad or anything, just some surgery I'm probably going to have to have. It's just to discuss some things that's going on. But anyway, um, I gotta go do that. Oh man. Well, I gotta put this up further. Look what I just did. But I want that little coffee bean thing up higher. that where I wanted it. <laughs> that was my little thing. So I'm probably not going to get any done tomorrow and I may get one more done today. So I may have two videos up this week, maybe, this coming week. So I'm sorry, but then I'll be gone a week and then I'll be back and I'll be back at it. I promise. So I won't have my video a week like normal. I'm sorry. But it is what it is. My daughter needs some help. and I'll get to go spend time with my granddaughter. So that's what it is. I'm sorry, y'all. But family and summer. <laughs> I'll go spend some time in their swimming pool. And see my grandbabies and my little granddaughter. I don't know if I've talked about it on here. But the baby... They were worried about her because she wasn't walking. She's 18 months old and she was not walking. You try to put her down and she'd just put those little legs up and she would not put weight on them. So um, they got her in therapy. The doctor got her in therapy. And she's walking. She's finally walking. Yay! She does. She's not walking all the time. She's still crawling a lot. But she can walk. So it's not that she can't. She just won't. <laughs> She's got the ability. So that's, you know, that's half the battle. Does she have the ability? Yes, she's got the ability. <laughs> she just won't do it. Oh, I gotta figure out where's. Here we go again. Here we go again, you guys. Where? Oh, I hear this. <laughs> Thought I lost it again. <laughs> I gotta figure out where that's gonna go. Um, 
so you know there for a while it was kind of like mm, is she not able to put any weight on those legs what's going on with those legs it was kind of a hmm what's going on but she came up now there's the other thing she doesn't talk very much she can say um mama and um i think she says dada or something she says it she has something that she says for dad and she says sissy or some form for sis and um i think that's about it but she's not talking and so again is it that she won't talk or she just isn't able to so there's several therapies that they need to get her in but my daughter is having trouble with all this running I sure wish I lived closer to her her husband is a police officer and so it's very hard for him to be around to um, you know, be able to help with all this travel during the day, and they live out in the country. They don't really, they don't call it the country, but man, to me, it's the country. Now, I'm wondering if I could make a thing there, because I don't really have room anywhere. Now, where is this one? This one, do I want to use this one, like right here, to make it... See, I could put that, and that would show right there. Yep, I'm going to do that. But I want to ink that up more. That's not very inked up. So she's just having a struggle. And this coming week, there's just a lot of things where she just really is going to have a hard time with the back and forth on some things. So... I can't remember why, but she just needs to be there. So. It might have something to do with her four, with my granddaughter, her 14-year-old daughter. She might have stuff that she's got to do, and she can't help her mama. I don't know. But anyway she is a very big help to her mom. She is a very grown up 14 year old. Okay, so then I put this right there. Yeah, see that really shows up there. I'm going to yeah, put this all the way over to the edge. I just love that, and it really shows the copy there. My magazine page, because this is very um, brittle. It'll tear real easy. It's from one of those really old, um, I think, Better Homes and Gardens cookbooks. And it was not in very good shape. I don't know what it was stored in all these years, maybe a garage, but it was not in the best of shape. I was telling my husband when I was, he was helping me look for coffee because I was having a hard time. And so he, he got my, he's like, what about your better homes and gardens down there? <laughs> he's the one that clued me into looking there. And uh, I said, you know what? Because my grandma, she had a library in her house. She had a big house. And she had a library. I said, you know what? I'd like to have a library like my grandma had. It'd be full of cookbooks and my old books that I cut stuff out of. <laughs> and I would have red carpet just like grandma. And I thought about it and I said, no, I'd have red tile. Because <laughs> I could... I could uh, sweep it up real easy, <laughs> but my grandma, she had a red carpet, and um, she just loved her red carpet. That, I don't know about that green, if that is bugging me, if I took that green off of there, I think I'm going to, that, that green is just bugging me. I don't know if I want it off or not, but it's bugging me. So if it's bugging me, I probably want it off. 
I probably didn't want it off now they're flying. <laughs> oh well. It was bugging me. But anyway, it'd probably be a scrapbook room instead of a library, but it would have all of the shelves like hers did. I have a picture of her and Grandpa in their library, and I love it. But she was so happy with her, um, I wish I could just put it right there. But I don't know if his head hanging off would bug me. I just don't know if that would bug me. I don't think it would. I'm going to put them there. So I don't want glue from there up. I think I'm going to use this glue. And y'all, I filled my glue. Oh, 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 I went off. I couldn't see the difference. Maybe I should better do it on here so I can see the difference. So that means I don't want to go above there on her head. Okay. And I will not not while I'm on while I'm recording because it will take me a while. But I will do something with something with a thicker cardstock or something, and I will trace it and put it back here so this isn't so flimsy. Because after a while, that will just tear and break off. So I will put Manila folder or something back there behind their heads to um, give that some support so that that won't because if I just leave it like that this old flimsy magazine paper then that eventually is just going to um, fold over and break off so that's what I do I will trace that and give that some support behind there if I'd have been thinking of it before this and known that I would have done that, I'd have done that to the whole thing. But I didn't know that, and I didn't want to take your time. And I guess I could have turned off the camera and done it, but I didn't. <laughs> but that's just a way to um, make sure. Oh, that's not coming off there make sure that that doesn't happen to that over time. Okay, so now I want to, I should have something over here for coffee, but I've, I'm out of coffee stuff, except for this. Yeah, I could do that. Okay, let's do that. use it. <laughs> I love coffee cake now. I have a coffee cake recipe that I put in my bread machine. Oh, it comes out so good. It is really delicious. And it's so easy. I haven't made that in a while. I need to make that. No, I don't. My husband is trying to lose weight so he can have a surgery. <laughs> I don't need to do that. show there is right there so I am going to tear this right there and right there I'm going to 
that right there in case that shows. Get some glue on there. This back on here where it's gonna go. So I want that. I want that right there. I think. Right there. Coffee cake. Okay. Do I want any of this down here, like the topping, or yeah, I like in a small bowl there. Yep. Let's put that. Oops! I just threw that. Okay. One, two. right here so I want in a small bowl I think I hope I've got this right to be right there is that right that's gonna be there oops nope it needs to be down a little bit ah okay oh my hands are sticky and my picture sticking to me and this is sticking to me and I'm not getting anything right Okay, that's right. Goodness. Okay, that's gonna be right there. That's gonna be right there. I don't think I can get anything. I'd love to get that bowl there, but I don't think I can. Let me, let me get it torn out and see. Nope, it's not going to work. Put that away for another thing. Okay, now let me get my tape out because this is going to go there. I always have to have that. I like to have that included. So it's going to be, this is going to be right here like this. And this is going to be like this. Oh, let's take this and turn this over. Pin. Oops, it was on. I'm doing a lovely job of riding around it. <laughs> Isn't that just wonderful? My hands, I've got to try to get some of this sticky off. Oh no, let me get my work. Get some alcohol. I'll get some of it off real quick. I will also take care of that. There we go. Then I gotta get a little bit of lotion on my hands because that just dried me up so fast. my friend Jody that gave me that she brought that to um, crop one week for all of us or one month to all of us and I have loved that thing didn't know I needed it <laughs> had no idea I needed that but I did <laughs> that I need let's go this way I need that to be No idea how much I would use an alcohol dispenser, a rubbing alcohol dispenser. <laughs> Let's get straight there in my room. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she meant for that to be rubbing alcohol. <laughs> 
that's what I have in it. Just got to put tape on the rest of them. Make it easy. say make it easy but you know I won't but we'll be trying to get all this back in off the air. I have trouble with that. Let's we'll see. Another thing here. Except for I need to have my husband try to get it. It's bent at the tip. I don't know what I was doing to it, but I got it bent. My little thing is full. I need to empty it in the trash can. Oh, see, I just have a terrible time. Maybe I'd do faster this way. I made me I put final on a t shirt last night. Oh my goodness, I chose a pattern that was, oh, wow, was, I picked and picked on it. I sat in front of the TV last night and picked on that thing. Whoa. <laughs> I chose a hard one. I didn't know it was going to be that difficult, but oh, is it pretty? Mm. I love it. really pretty. It says be the light and it's got light bulbs hanging down. It's really pretty. Those light bulbs. Whew. <laughs> now, will this go in there? I hope so. Yes. But that little part that didn't have be a pain I think okay I think oh I didn't stamp it anywhere let me get my stamp I forgot where it was because I moved it today is July 7th Oh, first of all, oh, I gotta cut the top of that off. Nope, <laughs> that won't work. That would look really, really, really strange. So here we go. There is my entry for today. I have something related to coffee, and I've got lots of coffee stuff, coffee cake, coffee stuff. Um, uh, something with a bit of pink is right here. Something in the shape of a hexagon is right here. A photo or a portion of a photo. Ink is right here. And the dictionary page is right here. And right there. And 
that is all. So let me hold it up close so that you can see it. Here we go. I didn't hold it. There's that coffee bean thing from the dictionary page. There's my hexagon. I really like using those quilt quilt uh, magazines. I find lots of ways to use the pictures of the quilts. And there's that kitchen. There's the coffee. Are those gold percolators? Am I right? I don't know. And then there's the coffee cup. Okay. Thank you so much for joining me today. You have a blessed day. I would love it if you give me a thumbs up and if you would subscribe to my subscribe to my ch channel, bleh, my channel that would be awesome. Um, and remember, I probably will not have very many uh, videos this week, but I will be back next week after I have a fun week with my grandchildren. I will see you soon. Bye bye.